Hi, welcome back to the channel. My name is Anastasia and I'm your go-to holistic health and fitness expert. In this channel, you will find multiple tips, correction, modification and suggestions how to live your life aligned with a holistic way of living, homeopathy, natural healing, Ayurveda, hence how to build the foundation of profound health, optimal health, longevity and anti-aging. I also assist towards any enthusiast and people who are inquiring for this transformation with the online coaching. So you are welcome to send me an inquiry message. I have links down below, LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram and email. Send me Anastasia. I want to have this free consultation with you and we will set up accordingly the time and the date and we will discuss where you are right now and how holistic way of living can transform your life in general in all aspects and for you to build yourself as the healthiest version of yourself. In today's video I want to share with you why mono food consumption and also mono as a simple food consumption promote and support your weight loss journey. So here you might think that simple and mono, it sounds a bit boring, a bit maybe tasteful, a bit kind of not for you, but let's reflect on this more deeper. So for example, mono and simple food consumption, what does it mean? It means when you are eating out, when there is a festive season, for example, right now we are during winter time where there is a lot of holidays happening and throughout the year you attend several events, several family gatherings, uh, work-related gatherings, corporate events, birthday party and there is a tradition to have a lot of food options and I'm talking here about also with your day-to-day -day food consumption, but also how you react and how is your food etiquette when you go out and what you follow, which kind of food habits you are following. Because overall, they are both important. What you eat day-to-day -day and what you eat when you step out, for example, for a treat, for an um, occasion, for the event. So here, very simple foundation. There is Mainly, there's a starters, there's appetizers, the appetizers, there is savory bites, there is main dishes, there is a canapé, a brusquette, and there is kind of like mini version of a five star hotel buffet, which is like lunch or dinner or breakfast, and you see there's varieties of all kind of food in one place, and you want to try all of them. But here, what you need to understand learn and remember for life. When you mix all this kind of food items, when the, you um, cultivate it, because we wasn't born with this um, lifestyle, we cultivated this through the TV channels, through the movies, through the, our colleagues, our spouse, our family members, our parents, uh, anyone could influence you. When you go out, you order appetizer, salad, main dish, dessert, there is a lot of pressure on your digestion system when you mix all of them. So what you need to do, you need to simplify your food intake to the mono intake, uh, intake and simple intake. And it's not only particularly to meet a goal to lose weight, it's also to optimize your weight to the potentials that your body have because most of us, we are not living out to our potentials that our body created, but we gather a lot of unnecessary kilograms, fats, etc. So when you simplify your food to the mono as simple food, you give your body a rest, you give yourself optimization to live up to the potential, and also you release so much pressure from your digestive system. And again, to remind you that all the thickness, 80% of the thickness are built up in your digestion system. So when digestion system is overworking, when you are continuously overeating, when you're mixing a lot of food items, fried, raw, baked, uh, sugar, chocolate, chicken, duck, salmon, everything in one seat, it does not support you your health, your digestion system, your immune system, they are all crying out. And when you are 20, 30, maybe 45, it's kind of a bit here and there adjustable to digest. But with the age, even after 40, for some people, even after 35, when you are continuously following this lifestyle, it's not only a result in the 
your body shape, how it changed with the age, how is your mobility going on, how you feel in your joints, what is your posture, how do you walk, how do you handle your body, and also your digestion tract, and what is your medical checkup, because you would see from your medical checkups what is your health condition, and of course, with an even natural healing and holistic way of living, the checkups is necessary to do and to recognize where you are having a certain struggle, where you have a risk and how to focus your nutrition, your workouts, your lifestyle around this area to improve. So what I'm suggesting here for you, wherever you are having your meal, do not go for any sort of appetizers and forget about dessert. You can have a dessert with your coffee, for example, if you are a coffee or a tea drinker, but do not drink it liquids and food together. When you have your, if you are a kind of person who have breakfast, lunch or dinner, or you have lunch, dinner, or you have breakfast and dinner, do not mix like dinner, salad, dessert, coffee, everything in one seat. You have food, you do not have any liquids together. 30 minutes before your food, 30 minutes better even one hour after your food. So 30 minutes before your food, one hour after your food. When you have a food items, have curry, have a full curry. So the texture of the dish is the same. When you choose a bowl of salad because you are craving for something fresh, not because you are on a diet when you need to have a minimum calorie intake, Choose it all raw materials inside the salad. Don't choose something that's been baked, the rice is there, the quinoa is there. I understand it's a great bowl for you to promote your weight loss, but you need to understand that it's still suffocation and suppression of your needs, of your cravings. So you better have a whole meal in the same texture, in the same calorie intake. Not necessarily in the same color intake, but I mean in the same texture, in the same flavor. So if it's raw material, use it all raw. If it's baked, use it all baked. If it's uh, soup, have it just a soup. With a, if you like to have with some bruschetta or with some toast, have it with some toast, but do not overcomplicate. Like you have soup, you have bruschetta with uh, buffalo cheese, and then you have some, um, what for example, baked salmon with uh, uh, raw vegetables it's not good mix for your digestion system so when you simplify you better you promote a better work for your digestive system which would result in a clean skin and a clean digestion in a smooth digestion in everyday digestion would exit the old stuff from your body your clean skin the good texture of your skin hence here it goes away all sort of anti uh, sort of all uh, unwanted wrinkles, puffiness, tiredness from your face and from your body, the soreness from your body. Also, you support your food intake and your portion control, but not from the stand that you are on the certain diets that you follow, but naturally you would feel satisfied naturally after one sit of a one plate because the mind is the same being distracted like when for example you are hungry and you go for a supermarket you are so distracted with all options like you want to have baguette you want to have a cheese you want to have a turkey you want to have banana you want to have everything at the same time because you're hungry so it's the same when you sit down when you have a food even when you order in a restaurant when you order many things and they keep coming you want to indulge all of them or if you are dining with someone else and they order something else you want to try this also but when you focus only in one feel uh, only in one meal it simplify your feelings your emotions so here it's also result number three a mindful eating where you indulge in every bite of your food you are here and now which is also a very important aspect in nutrition, in a weight loss, in your health, in psychosomatic health, in mental health, because you are not jumping around the options around what to eat and how to indulge and how to satisfy it and what would be next and did I have still space. You are fully present on one meal, you're enjoying your meal and you know you are done here, you will have a water after one hour. And it's not, you need to look at it not from the stance that it's hard, or it's exhausting or it's difficult. You need to think about this in a long term. I am very often repeating this phrase, long term satisfaction in my videos. If you are looking at my videos here and there often, I always repeat a phrase, 
long-term satisfaction. So when you have a bite of chocolate cake, it's a fast term satisfaction but when you have a great meal for example um, roasted vegetables potato carrot pumpkin in one seat and uh, you enjoy you satisfied you get those like great texture of the vegetables you feel enough you feel like you are not bloated you don't feel tired you feel still active after lunch to go for a walk to go for a meeting to put a smile on your face is not difficult because you do not feel tired like how would you feel after one steak and um, uh, french fries and some uh, mayo salad and one cork but here what it means a long-term satisfaction you are still alive you are still full of energy even more with the energy after your meal how it should be you shouldn't be dropping on the energy you should increase on your energy battery and hence you result in a great work etiquette food etiquette your body etiquette is all efficient also number four it uh, supports your immune system because again to highlight that 80 percent of your immune system is allocated in your digestion tract so when you are continuously eating here and there mixing all kind of textures desert soup salad bake it fresh raw meat duck fish uh, seafood everything in one seat in one day even because all of these items need a different time to digest for example vegetables and fruits raw materials it goes under one hour whereas meat some kind of meat takes even six to eight hours again depends on your gut health and your gut microbiome for some people it's even might take up to 20 hours that's why you are suffering with a bloating constipation gas uh, feeling like puffiness in your body because you are not choosing wisely your food mixtures and in the name of short-term satisfaction you are continuously suffering in your life because even your lunch is over you are working you are with your family you are with your spouse you are with your partner you are with a uh, your boss or with your colleague you are thinking about your digestion how you feel awful how you feel terrible and how you need to find out some medicine quickly to quickly fix it again the quick term or short term satisfaction so this is part what i want to highlight and share it with you that anytime you choose your food is it's your breakfast lunch dinner your coffee your tea time it's all great but you just need to choose wisely from a stand to simplify even when you go for a uh, Porsche and fancy even and there is so many options there is a wine champagne there is a duck uh, there is uh, profiteroles there is caviar choose mono if you choose to eat seafood eat seafood even if those pork it's wrinkle at you if you choose to go for desert choose one desert choose something that is just chocolate do not mix all colorful creams and profiterol and creme brulee in one seat choose it wisely so you support and you are in one team with your digestion system with your immune system and hence it would result in your weight stable weight the happy body image that you will see in your mirror the glowing skin on your face on your body your unshakable immune system and anti-aging would speak up louder than i promise so if you feel that i can assist you here in this area where you are feeling that you have certain aspect of struggle i remind you that send me a message send me anastasia i want to have this free consultation call free consultation call whatever uh, message body you will choose we will set up the time and day we will meet and i will teach you how to transform how to live effortlessly how to nourish yourself and to be the best version of yourself this is it for this video do not forget to share with someone who might take away some insightful information from this video as well let's grow this community together let's build this healthy community together and i will see you in the next video